Tron has arrived. You know, it's not every day that we get a new attraction at Walt Disney World, so I'm going to very much enjoy this. following the blue lollipops and the cast members all the way down on that right hand side through those gates. Otherwise, if you're not here for Tron, that's okay. You're welcome to play in the Magic Kingdom as much as you want today. But if you're interested in that Tron merchandise specifically, you're going to go all the way down this is my So yeah, as you heard the cast members say, the merchandise, to purchase Tron merchandise, there's a special entrance which is the uh, sideway, the, the side street down Main Street. So we're gonna head down there and see what that's all about. Just walking down, I see this brand new item available in the confectionery today. We have a Rice Krispie Treat and a caramel apple. Absolutely. That looks amazing. Dark chocolate. Dark chocolate even. Mm -hmm. Ooh, with the Tron chocolate pendants on there. Yep, choose your team. That's awesome. Yeah, that's <laughs> that looks good. I'm curious to see like what this little pop-up shop is. Now the store for Tron, which has a digitization experience, is not opening today. So, Welcome. thank Good you. Morning, Good morning. It's not open today, so I'm kind of curious to see um, how that's going to work. Um, I'm going to try and gain access to the store if I can. Greetings. Greetings. Oh. What's up guys? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yeah. This is an area you don't really get to go back to very much. We got a great view of Tron. Hey, how's it going? We got a great view of lots of fun, beautiful castle views right here, actually, really cool. All right, status update. We've been in this uh, merchandise event queue for about 15, 10, 15 minutes. And it does loop all the way around the old Stitch Escape, Great Escape building. I'm thinking it's probably about a 30 to 45 minute wait in total, but we shall see. There's lots of fun friends here. We got Resort TV over here. I saw Adam the Woo back over here. I saw Mickey Chat earlier. So lots of friends here today. It's gonna be a good one, guys. All right, great news. We are on the move. We are on the hunt for Tron merchandise. We've moved, we've moved 15 feet. This is good though. 15 feet is better than no feet. Oh, rope drop guys. Opening ceremonies have commenced at the Magic Kingdom on April 4th, 2023. Opening day for Tron, super excited to be here. It's gonna be a good day. We're moving, we're moving. This is good. This is very good news. I was thinking this line was gonna take forever. Merchandise event right there. One of my favorite views of the castle coming up. Oh boy. I have not been back here in so long. I have missed this view. Wow, look at this beautiful old Tomorrowland. So we're going to call it Old Tomorrowland. <laughs> Even got some rust up there. It's looking good. You know, it just adds to the theming, you know? All of the guests 
going for rope drop, probably headed to the mine train, but here we are. We are here for something new and unique, Tron merchandise. Just through these doors, or those doors. I'm not sure which doors. <laughs> Single rider. Thank you. Oh, I'll follow my friends then. We got Resort TV one offering us an amazing live stream right now. I just want to say shout out to them. If you guys like live streams, make sure you watch theirs. They're the only ones I watch, so if you guys watch them. Yes, and she's really sweet too, really nice. And Dale's nice too, but yeah, you're nice. Thank you, I appreciate it. We have entered not the grid. This is not the grid, this is something else entirely. <laughs> It smells vintage in here. Oh boy, here we go. How many? Come on in, would you like a bag? Sure. Oh, they are prepared. They have bags for us and everything. How oh, many? Just one. It'll be just a moment. Oh. <laughs> it was like the adrenaline and then, uh, it's okay. I just need to find me a double X shirt, that's it. Before they're all sold out. Here we go, I can see some of the opening day shirts. This is really cool though. They've got this shop set up for us. It's awesome. So we do have Star Traders open as well, but it's the same merchandise in both areas, so we could get more desk. Oh, that's awesome. I'm just gonna take a I'm just gonna take a couple of these. We got the magic band. What's this one look like? Right now. Yeah. Good job. That is cool looking. All right. All right, we have our first basket filled. The store is incredible though, guys. This is inside of Stitch's Great Escape. I'm gonna see what the damage comes out to you so far. 31.94. Amon's gonna give us a little, maybe a little discount maybe. <laughs> and these really cool Flynn's Arcade sign tokens. Those are really cool. I have to pick up some of those. Wow, look at this bag. Look at this thing. Whoa, Kenneth and Kara, hey, good to meet you, brother. <laughs> yes, we have Tron merch. We have exited the store, the retail location, and I have spent quite a bit of money. I will do a full haul video. I'll post the link up here in the corner. But yes, very successful shopping session. I pretty much got everything that I wanted to get in my size, which is the key thing, being a good, a big tall guy I need that double X and those sizes always sell out quick but I got them I gotta go put this away I also wanted to shout out to the amazing team here at Disney and the cast members did an absolute absolutely phenomenal job organizing all the crowds for the merchandise event they did great there was it was orderly it was efficient it was timely and the experience was amazing. Compared to some other retail events that I've done here in the past where it's just kind of mass chaos, trying to find everything you want, it was great. All right guys, well it's time to change my uniform and go enter the grid. Changing, three, two, one. <laughs> Whoa, whoa. We have our Tron opening day shirt on guys. We are super excited to be here. Anyways, we got a few hours before we can attempt to secure a 1 p.m. virtual queue, so we're gonna ride some rides. I think Space Mountain. Yep. We're gonna ride Space Mountain. Oh, it's not Tron, but hey, it's close to Tron. Let's get some Space Mountain going. Time for the people mover. That's right, we're gonna get an aerial view of the Tron area, see what the crowd levels are like from the sky. This is the TTA Blue Line, non-stop service around Tomorrowland. Quite a few people are in Tomorrowland today. Greetings intergalactic travelers. Welcome aboard the People Loop, presented by Enterprise. I'm Laura Fine, your guide aboard this highway in the sky. Now approaching Tomorrowland Speedway and Tron Light Cycle Run. I love a good circuit, and these are two of the best tracks of the cosmos for a bit of light speedy competition. Hey guys, my Tron shirt glows in the dark. Woo! Look at that. To 
to your right is the Astro Orbiter, our celestial symbol of interplanetary harmony and fellowship. Hop aboard and launch high above Tomorrowland for a spin amongst the planets. All right, guys, so it's been 2,089 days since this attraction was announced back in 2017. 2,089 days? What? Five years, eight months, and 20 days. If you're more into months, that's 68 months, 20 days, excluding today. Or if you like months, that's 68 months and 20 days. 180,489,600 and 600 seconds. 3,008,160 minutes. 50,136 hours or 2,089 days. That is a long time to wait. Worth the wait. Indeed it is. I'm stoked for it, guys. Are you? We are back in the Tron area once again. And I have some bad news. Yes, sadly, at 1 p.m. sharp, your man here, the single rider, was on the My Disney Experience app. Plus, press refresh immediately. No hesitation, just as I have done countless times before for Rise of the Resistance, Guardians of the Galaxy, and Tron. But I received a strange error message and was not able to procure a reservation for today, sadly. But yeah, just a little bummed out that you know, I don't get to ride on opening day. But hey, been able to do this ride preview a few times, so I'm happy. You know, guys, I'm not gonna lie, sitting down over here just watching everyone go on Tron finally is making me super, super happy. <laughs> They're just flying overhead, having a great time, screaming. And I'm just sitting here, just happy for them. Even though I cannot go today, I'm thrilled for everyone who's getting to. and all these people get to finally experience this attraction guys it's been such a long time in the making and for all these people to finally get to be here I remember the first time when I came during cast member previews how excited I was and I can only imagine how all these amazing people are feeling right now so very very exciting for them I'm excited for them definitely a uh, different vibe going on today versus the previews and the soft open it's a lot more people sitting around waiting for their virtual queues, waiting for their lightning lanes. You can just see from the crowds here behind me how many more people there are. But that is a good thing. It's adding capacity to the parks. It's getting more people here, getting the things that we've been waiting for for so long. I know you can't see it right now, but there's a railroad. Walt Disney Railroad is currently going underneath this entire tunnel right here and that's how it gets back to its original route and that's one of the reasons why this attraction took so long to build is because they had to reroute the train and build this special canopy create the illusion of Tomorrowland I decided to, uh, since it's such a warm, hot day, decided to stop by Energy Bites, kind of try one of these watermelon refreshers. You know, it is hot, it's like 91, 92 degrees. I need something cool. All right, we have procured the watermelon cooler. Let's go try it out, guys. Sorry, it's not focusing very well. It's got some pop rocks in it, so that's exciting. Let's try it out. Ooh. Weird. <laughs> Good. I like it. It's refreshing and very, very sweet. I don't know if you can see in here, but there are pop rocks in there. It's basically just a watermelon slushy with pop rocks in it. I'm feeling like I need a straw though. It's a little hard to get out. Yeah, get, get a straw if you get this. <laughs> I gotta go back and get one. A little hot tip for you guys. If you get the watermelon refresher, and it's too solid for you, just wait about three minutes in the Florida heat. It is now completely melted. By the time I got back here to get a spoon, I didn't need it anymore. And now I have really red lips. I can't believe it. We are going on Tron on opening day. Been here all day. 
been wanting to go, been seeing everyone so happy, but now it is my turn to go. So exciting, let's go. You should be free from high blood pressure, heart, back, or neck problems. You should be free from motion sickness. Oh, here we go. Prepare to be digitized into the world of trauma. It's nice and cool in here. Feels nice. In the life cycle run, there are winners and there are losers. Oh yeah, I'm feeling the Tron vibes now, guys. We are officially inside. So excited. April 4th, 2023, we have made it. Tron is finally here for all of our enjoyment. Although I did have a little bit of an issue getting a virtual queue today. Thankfully, some friends helped me get on. So, super, super stoked. And yes, I do still have to ride in the back seat because I'm six foot six, almost seven. And these seats are not made for big boys like myself. So I will be riding in the rear rover seat and probably will be for the perpetual future from today on. Guys, it's been an amazing day. April 4th, 2023, Tron Life Cycle Run has finally arrived to the Magic Kingdom. And you can hear all the screams. You can tell from my hair. It was a great time with some great people. We were able to check out amazing merch. I will, do, I will be doing a separate video on all of the merchandise I was able to pick up. Check out the link right here if you haven't seen that whole entire video. I spent a lot of money, more money than I should have, but it was great fun had special access to the store. Wow, what an amazing day, guys. Thanks so much for coming along with me, guys. Uh, I know there's a lot of people out there that you could be watching, but I appreciate you guys watching with me today, sharing this experience with me. It means a lot. If you guys want to help support the channel, I'll leave a little link in the description. You guys can, you know, buy me a treat. 50 cents here and there, you know, help me out. That'd be awesome, guys. Help the little guys. I don't make anything on YouTube, guys. So anything you guys can do to help support the channel is much appreciated. You guys keep being awesome. Be true to yourself. We'll see you next time, or we'll see you on the grid. Peace out.